Hey guys, I'm Loy and I'm with Design Wall. I'm going to be helping you customize your WordPress theme with its own admin dashboard. It'll be completely yours. Thanks. Create a new child theme. First, you got to make sure you're logged in as an admin to WordPress. Next, create a directory within your WordPress folder. Name it whatever you like, but we're going to call this one the child theme. You can use whatever editor you like, but I like Adam. Within the child theme, create a new file, style.css. We're going to go ahead and copy over the header just to keep our files organized. Next, you got to create a new file, functions.php. Afterwards, you can go to our paste bin and copy our code in order to get access to our theme. Save, hit refresh, go to appearance and themes, and then activate your child theme. Bam, it's right there. Hiding and showing widgets, default method. By default, WordPress gives you checkboxes. That way you can hide and show widgets. Neat, as you can see, checking and unchecking will either reveal or hide the widgets. Hiding and showing widgets. Insert code into functions PHP. First you gotta go to our paste bin and find the correct code. It's all right here. Depending on which widget you want to hide, you have to choose the correct name. So look through them. Inspect the elements carefully. Here's the code for you though. We're gonna go ahead and remove everything. We copied and pasted the code into Adam. Refreshed, and now you can see that all the widgets are hidden. Awesome. Find and remove other widgets. Some widgets come default, but since WordPress is open source, you can edit the code. All you have to do is open up the inspect tool and then find the div ID. In this case, it's called WooCommerce underscore dashboard underscore recent underscore reviews. Copy it, add it to the remove dashboard meta and insert the appropriate name. Dashboard. Whoops. Normal. Bam. Now it's all gone. Isn't that cool? It's even hidden up there. Remove submenus. Once again, you go to our paste bin, we provide the code for you. Copy the function remove menus, and then paste it into functions PHP. Save. Refresh. And now you can see that all the menus are hidden. They're gone. No one can access them anymore. No one can access them again until you change the code. Now we're going to go ahead and put back the appearance menu. And you can see it reappears with all the submenus. Neat! Creating a new widget. That's pretty neat. Once again, to add a widget to the dashboard, go to our paste bin, copy the function DW add dashboard widgets and add action, and then paste the function into your functions.php file. Now you'll see a custom widget. Isn't that cool? Look at it. It's sure to look personalized. It's even in the drop down menu up top. Lastly, customize footer text. This is an important element to add personality to your theme. At the very bottom, you can see that WordPress left their stamp. Let's leave one of our own. Copy and paste. Paste into functions.php. That's a good skill that every coder has. Built with love by design wall. Now you can leave your stamp. 
Thanks for viewing. Remember to like and subscribe if you want to stay in tune for more. Thank you.